Good morning, my name is Wayne Caragino. I'm the project manager on um, the dredge projects in the city of Cocoa Beach. Uh, we're here today on our muck dredging project, which consists of dredging 36 canals in the city of Cocoa Beach. More particularly today, we're at phase three of our project, which consists of dredging 13 canals south of the Minuteman Causeway. The project is designed to remove the muck from the bottom of the canals and um, in the process improve the quality of the water for the enjoyment of the public and for the benefit of the wildlife. The big challenge here and all the communities beachside is the, the spoil containment areas. Uh, the spoil site we're working with on this project is very small in comparison to most of the, uh, the spoil sites that, that people have the luxury of using. So we occasionally have to stop and, and empty the spoil site out, but um, we, we have to basically work with what we have. The material is pumped from this dredge behind me and it's pumped quite a distance in, in excess of a mile and a half. So we have intermediate pumps which re-energize the slurry and keep it moving down the line. And, uh, and then we dry it out and process it and, and it gets taken away. We've been very successful in this because of our partnership with numerous agencies, number one, the uh, Save Our Indian River Lagoon Fund, which is contributing to this project along with St. John's River Water Management uh, District and um, the Florida Department of Environmental Protection and the city. The city kicked in on uh, numerous aspects of the project. We manage the project. It's a terrific thing because we're all working together for a common goal, which is to improve the lagoon and, and the environment. We've actually gotten positive feedback from a number of, um, of residents that have lived here for, for a long time and uh, they've noticed uh, more wildlife in the area, uh, more fish, they can actually fish off their docks now. Many more dolphin, manatee uh, are being attracted to the area. It's kind of a subjective um, evaluation of it, but it, it's something that we cherish because that's what we're doing this for. And we appreciate the positive feedback from our citizens.